hello everyone welcome or welcome back to my channel on today's video i share with you how i upgraded the beautiful candle holders using items mostly purchased at the dollar tree as you see here i have them like pedestals but you can just use them for candles a little decorative item or even for a vase of flowers so if you're interested Please continue watching. A while back, I made these lovely stands using Dollar Tree candle holders for an event that I held. And today, I decided to give them a makeover using the following spray paints. I have here the Krylon All-in-One Paint and Primer in a glossy black. And I have also the Rust-Oleum Metallic Finish Paints in silver and in gold so guys let's get to painting now before painting them we're gonna make sure they're nice and clean by wiping them down with some rubbing alcohol Alrighty, everyone so now that they are dry from the rubbing alcohol we're gonna give them the first coat of paint well we'll see how many coats the black paint will take anyway Dry and move on with the next one. Here we are painting the silver ones now. And last but not least, here goes the gold one. I just love the way these metallic paints look on the glass. I think they look stunning and they look very glam as you can see. Alrighty guys, so we'll allow these to dry well and then we will embellish them. Alrighty guys, as you can see, our little pedestals have dried. The silver one, the gold one. I think the gold one's my favorite. What about you? But the black one does look stunning, guys. Now, remember I said we were going to give it a little a makeover by embellishing them a little bit. So, I have my rhinestone ring wrap in the gold and the silver. These I did get on Amazon. And we also have the option of using the diamond wrap from the Dollar Tree. I have it in the silver and in the gold. So the first thing we're going to do, I will determine that we will do the silver rhinestone wrap on the gold, maybe on the black one, not sure. Well, let's try it on the black one. We'll do first the bottom, the, the little um, lip here. I'm just gonna place a dab of hot glue and go around. You can use P6000 or fix all adhesive if you do so please and obviously that'll give you a more permanent hold because we know that with the hot glue it's just something temporary not to say that it won't last but it's more temporary so there we have it here now on the little bottom of the tray and now I'm going to add it here to the lip of the candle holder. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to take the strip and I will be cutting it right in the middle. And from there, I'll trace it out here first to make sure that we have the right amount right here. And then this will be cutting it down the middle and gluing it along the lip here so let me cut this down and be right back alrighty guys so i'm going to add a little bit of hot glue here and we're going to start going round and round here with our 
explain that. Remember it says just to lift and you can add the solar adhesive or E6000 if you so please. I will be probably just on this here on the top part just adding a mix of both just to make sure that it stays nice and, and strong and in place. Never forgetting guys to be very careful because hot glue is hot. Right, and I'll go around on this one and then I'll do the others and we'll be back. Alright you guys, now that the black one is done, we will be doing the same thing to our gold one, adding the silver diamond wrap. Not diamond wrap, um, rhinestone wrap, but you can do diamond wrap if that's what you have. guys my phone had a call so my video got cut off but here I am doing the wrap the diamond wrap in gold on our silver handle holder I'm just finishing it up here and there we have it everyone Here is the silver one with the gold. Look how pretty that looks. How nice and blingy. I love it. I love how blingy it looks. So guys, here are all three. I don't know if you can see them well there. But, here you have them. Beautiful, elegant, glam, definitely glam. Candle holders, items mostly purchased at the Dollar Tree. So guys, I thank you for watching. I thank you once again for tuning in. If you haven't already done so, please consider subscribing to my channel. Don't forget to give my video a thumbs up and leave me a comment down below. Also, don't forget to um, share my videos. Help my channel grow by sharing my videos. And once again, I thank you for watching. And blessings to you all, guys. Blessings to you all.